communicator, uh, much no resistance, like to have fun too. Gemini, Gemini, what you got to say now? Ah, 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 Gemini, what's going on, y'all? If you like this video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. I always like to have you guys back. Um, if you guys like to donate, and down below will be my cash app. All right, guys. What you got to say? Let's figure out um, what this person... Um, what's this person... What's on this person's mind about the situation? And we'll go from there, right? <laughs> All right. Hey, y'all enjoyed y'all weekend? Y'all enjoyed y'all Monday? Hey, Monday's always fucking slow. No one wants to go to work on fucking Monday. <laughs> All right, let's get to this reading. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take that one because that's just a yes or no. All right. This person, I feel, honestly, just looking at this, I feel like this person's bored and lonely since you've been gone, since you've been, you know, been away from this person or whatever the case may be. Um, I got lonely, bored. So I feel like this person, the time has been kind of moving slowly for this person here. Um, being away from you has definitely done something to this person feel like you know how you when you have anxiety hold on and time starts to move fat slower i mean not faster slower all right, six all right this person's afraid to come towards you gemini i feel like they're trying to find creative ways to get to you um this person disappointed you all right Person wants to have you as a trophy. Alright. Person is thankful that they met you though. I think they, they know that it was a good they met you. They they're thankful for it. Um they're disappointed though um, about some things and they could be a little bit resistant, but I have a feeling like, you know, they would come towards you. Let's go another round. Communicator, uh, emotional resistance. <laughs> I don't know why I come up with these damn songs. <laughs> All right, let's see what else they got on their mind. Oh, that's too many cards. Chris has been longing for you. I feel like they want to they want to be more open with the vulnerability card here i feel like there was a fight though that happened between y'all things were said uh, they feel exhausted but they believe they can make this work with you again they're afraid again they want to be with you they're desperately okay so they're longing for you they want to be more vulnerable this time around. I feel like vulnerability is a big thing because, look, you guys get in the fights a lot. I don't know what it's about. Um, there's some exhaustion and somebody's afraid to come towards you. But they believe they can make this work with you and they desperately are holding on to this connection. So let's get into your tarot. All right, what's the overall everything? Gemini. What's going on with Gemini? Gemini in love. Gemini in love. Yeah, yeah. All right. Gemini in love. Motherfucker. All right. <laughs> Feeling silly today. Come on. Come on, Gemini in love. Queen of Swords. 
Yeah, you might be making, you might be trying to get yourself to a more emotionally balanced place with the Queen of Swords here. Uh, like you want the truth about a situation, about somebody talking some shit, maybe. I'm getting here with an emotional instability. I have, uh, this person was just not on your level mentally speaking. Um, the person could have been unfaithful to you. Um, they're just shallow personality. Um, overly emotional, just all that negative crazy shit. Yep. Uh, oh boy. Yeah. Um, could have been doing the Aries. I'm talking about the signs here. I got, uh, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Aries, Capricorn, some earth signs. Okay, this person was very uh, childlike in their behavior. Um, they did things without thinking. Um, they didn't like to submit to you or to anybody's demands. They were like that type of person that, you know, went against a lot of things that you believed in. Also, this person was a very risky person. Um, they made crazy ass decisions about situations that led to the end of this relationship here. But when they look back in the past and they see all the work they did, they do miss you from time to time with the Seven of Pentacles here. They do miss you. They do think about this. Um, also thinking like they're trying to plan a way to come back. And this is the first card here. The Fool in Reverse here. All right. So let's get into clarifications here with the Fool in Reverse. This person like a nut, a nut basket. <laughs> Person looking like a piece of fucking shit. All right, let's go. Let's go anyway. Person wants to open up to the Eight of Swords here. They're sure about that. They want to open up again, even though they were foolish. It was on their worst behavior, yes, because they want to feel stable again with you. All right, let me show you these cards here. We'll move on. Oh, fuck me. All right. Clarify the Seven of Pentacles on, you know, figure that shit out. Pentacles. Oh, the devil in reverse, yeah. Yeah. There was no reason why this person was acting the way they were acting. I feel like there was no reason just because, you know, they wanted to be that. I feel like this person, to be honest with you, I feel like this person just is just not really good at relationships, to be honest. Um, they could have been attractive or something. That was probably the reason why you you went after them. But I think the more you got to get to know this person, you found out they had a lot of negative qualities about themselves. And it, it wasn't it, it was nothing that justified what they did. But then when they try to come off like, oh, I was just trying to, you know, I was just trying to, you know, they always make excuses for themselves. Oh, I was, you know, I really want to do this. I really want to do, I really was expecting this. I really was trying to get this outcome. But it's like, motherfucker, you keep doing stupid shit. But that ain't what I meant, though. That ain't what I meant, though. Right? Why was this person acting like this? Why was this person acting like this? Because they just think about themselves first. Nine of Pentacles. Yeah. Yeah, they don't consider your emotions about things. They can come off like they don't really care about your emotions, actually. And they don't even really, really, really fully like talking about their emotions. Um, this person just is sadistic. I'm getting, um, with the King of Swords and the Devil in reverse, this person was on their fucking worst behavior, okay? They're not good at handling their own emotions. Even though they try to come off like they are, you know, they they try to come off like, oh, I got everything under control, but why the fuck you keep getting in, doing dumb shit to me? Why you keep putting me in dumb ass situations? Give me an emotion about this person here, again. There's too many cards, but this one fell down. Yeah, at the time the person just wanted to do what they wanted to do, 
They wanted to be independent away from this relationship, which caused a lot of friction. With the devil card in reverse, it could have been dealing with others. Um, I'm just going to leave that out there. I feel like you see that this person was being dishonest. Mm -hmm. They put this whole relationship at jeopardy because they wanted to go out and do stupid shit. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles in reverse here. Yeah, and you, you came in and you said something to this person. Yeah, how much a fucking fool they were. And you're holding back from this person because... You know the fool card here? I think about the fool card. I think about somebody who just takes all their shit and walks over the edge of the cliff. Like, that's not a type of person... I don't know. Do you like to skydive without a parachute? I don't fucking know, but... I feel like you came in. Look at the Knight of Swords here. I feel like you came in, spoke to this fucking foolish person here. And now you're like, okay, now I'm going to hold back from you. All right? This person didn't like that shit when you, when you came to them like this. They already got, they're ready to fight. They're ready to fucking stand up for their shit. Because you come with the Knight of Swords in the upright. They come with the Knight of Swords in the, in the um, reversal. So they're coming more on that fucking ready to fight you shit. Ready to be emotionally immature and shit with you. Ready to the, the fucking sabotage shit with you. But how are they going to get back with you? Oh, I know why. Because it used to work in the past. But it doesn't work anymore. Because you're tired of this fool. Alright. This bitch ass fool. Get your bitch ass fool up out of here. Get your bitch ass fool. <laughs> West Coast motherfucker. All right, what's going on here with Knight of Swords here? This person acts like they want to walk away, then they come back and they open up, and then they get mad, they walk away, they come back, they they go fuck with some third-party situation, look at the lovers, this person in the background, you know, Eight of Cups in reverse, meaning they fucking fake like they walk away, come back, want to be with you, then they open up to you again, then they fucking want to fight you again. I mean, it's an endless cycle of bullshit. All right. You get to the point where you're wanting to protect your feelings, protect yourself from this devil. Ah, devil, all right? Ah. <laughs> this person has done a lot of fucked up shit to you to keep you, to keep you connected to them. Is what I think about the devil. I think about, you know, this person using other things and other situations and a manipulation of things to keep you t tied to them, to keep you obsessed with them. And it's been a lot of fucking, it's been, it's brought you a lot of heartbreak. But I feel like you're starting to figure this shit out with this person here. What else sounds I got here? I got Aries, I got Leo, I got Sagittarius, Gemini. I feel like you're the lover that they keep coming to because you're in the, you're in this deck here with them walking away and coming back, opening up, fighting you. Yeah, you're in the middle, Gemini. All right. Let's clarify this three of swords here. You're no longer afraid of this person. You're no longer taking their shit with the nine of rods in reverse. It's like you're no longer like being defensive. You're like, motherfucker, I'm going to cost the tower now. Yeah, because I want a better relationship. You're like, I'm going to cost the fucking tower myself. Not you this time, bitch. It's a showtime, bitch. <laughs> All right, uh, the devil. <laughs> the devil. Get the devil. Alright, I'm not gonna take all that. This shit got too many cards. Alright, the devil. Yeah, you want victory over this damn devil. This selfish fucker. Yeah, you're not waiting on this person anymore. Because it's not your wish fulfillment. It's not something that. Makes you feel full, makes you feel joyful. Look at that. You got two reversals here. You want victory over this. <sighs> All right. All right, how would this be? How would this person be if they were to come in? Twerk my Gemini. How would this person be if they were to come in? Twerk my Gemini. 
Like they have, like, like they're trying to be humble. But guess what? As much as this person tries to keep you tied up in their shit, guess what? This person's tied to you too. So they don't try to come in like they're just, you know, like they've been taking some time to rest, reflect when they've been out here running these streets. All right, what about new? That was new coming. All uprights. If somebody who wants to come towards you, maybe a Sagittarius who wants your attention. So let's get some Oracle advice here. Notice the surroundings that you have people coming towards you. You have miracles, things that you can get into, things that you can do. You know what I'm saying? Continue to work on yourself. Continue to work on your craft and who you are. Let's pull one from the spiritual message. It says, dance like everyone else can go fuck themselves. It says, we cut ourselves from joy far too often because we worry about what others will think of us. Take a moment today to look around and silently tell everyone to go fuck themselves. Then dance. <laughs> See? All right. With that being said, call upon the tarot gods and end this motherfucker right now. Yeah, do what you want to do. If you like the video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you guys. Bye, Gemini.